and get him while he's down. Get him while he's down. Get him while he's down. Just slam him in the back of the head. Come on. Okay, I think he's dead. I think that was a little bit of overkill. Good morning, everyone. Dave from the Wee Hours here today checking out Humanit-Z, which does not roll off the tongue as easily as one might like. Humanit-Z. Humanit-Z? Anyway, there's going to be zombies and we're all alone and we're going to have to survive and fend them off and try and build some sort of something somewhere. I don't really remember. I did the demo of this ages ago, one of the Steam Next Fest. I never ended up putting it on the channel, but I played the demo myself, and there was enough of it where I'm like, yeah, I could give this another shot. So let's check out what we've got in Humanit-Z. I think this is about as good as I'm going to look during the zombie apocalypse. My profession is unemployed, which is not surprising. Again, it's the zombie apocalypse. I'm gonna... I'm gonna think the job market is a little bit tight right now. What are my other options? I could be a mechanic... 50% more effective with repair kits. That sounds really handy. Junior biodiesel researcher. Junior, mind you. 50% more fuel when using fuel cans. Emergency medical technician. 25% more effective with medical items. Apprentice gunsmith. That's obviously going to be better with gun repair kits. Amateur boxer. My hands deal 300% more damage. Three. 100% more damage in unarmed combat. Farmer, okay, increased amount of seeds from eating raw vegetables. Food surface worker. Oh, cool, I was behind the counter at Burger King. 15% more effective with all food items. Yeah, the stuff you find in food service is not really food, though, is it? You know what? I'm sticking with unemployed. I have no useful skills or perks. That sounds just about right. Would I like to play the tutorial? Oh, God, yes, it's been ages since I played this. Well, I've got a little obstacle course to go through here, and I can vault, 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 vault that, vault, vault that? Okay, how about climbing over? Can we do climbing over? How about we do... There we go. Okay, we're climbing over. The climbing over is working out really, really well. Um, no, I'm just... I'm not... I'm not so good. Yes, take notice of my vitals. I'm, I'm working on vaulting. Okay, try the other one. What was this one? This was... Kind of getting up and then falling over. Got it. Okay. We're not good at vaulting. We're pretty good at climbing things. Zombie ahead. Practice rotating the camera. Uh, sure. Time permitting. Yeah. Uh, I can sprint. Okay. So we could do that. Yep. Get a little sprinting action going on here. And zombies ahead. I got to figure they're not kidding. Uh, head back and climb over the fence. Oh, so run away. All right. And cl climb. There we go. Climbing over the fence. Um, and F is going to allow me to interact, tab will open and close my inventory. Fantastic. Do I have anything in my inventory? I got my clothes. Great. I have nothing else. I have a single apple. I could consume it, swap it, or drop it. Right on. Um, get out of that. I'll look at crafting and skills in a sec. I probably should have paid attention to the vitals thing. So health, and then food and water and energy. Pretty typical stuff there. Remember to pick up items or interact with them. I need to be facing it. Okay, can I have this? Can I have that? No, that's punching it. Punching it. Oh, interact. There we go. All right, get the water bottle. See, oh, no, 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 we don't do that. See what else might be around in the area here. No, not a lot. Okay, I, no, no, stop punching. And I have just discarded my plastic water bottle on the ground, which was extremely rude. Uh, interact with the backpack. I mean, I get it. We're not as worried about being eco-friendly right at this moment, but still, that was kind of rude. So I've got a backpack. What do I... I want to do that. I want to have that. No, give me this. All right, yes, take that. And then, okay, now I've got my backpack on. Gotcha. Uh, water bottle. No water bottle. Take that. Okay, are these gloves? Can, can My character can carry 35 kilograms. Uh, my stamina will be impacted. So, okay, so I've got a carry weight there. I can't have the gloves. Three car batteries. I gotta tell you right now, dude, I can't get one car battery. Those things are way heavier than they look. And then immediately drop the batteries because I'm carrying three car batteries. Should I maybe keep one? I mean, a car battery sounds like a really useful thing to have in the apocalypse. Should I? I'm gonna take one of those back. Give me one. I feel I can carry one of these. Okay. Try looting the containers for items. Yes, absolutely. We love looting. Uh, that's a zombie over there, by the way. That is a zombie. I've got nails and duct tape. Fantastic. Those are... No, take all of those. Thank you. Those are very obvious things that we need. How about the dumpster? What's going on in here? We've got barbed wire. Ooh, that sounds good. Bet you I could wrap that around a baseball bat or two. Now, what am I going to do with Sparky over here, Mr. Tutorial Ninja? 
Okay, open my inventory and drop my backpack if I need to. All right, so if I needed to really get away in a hurry, I could just dump my gear. Okay, let's shuffle, shuffle our way over there. Okay, right to enter and exit combat and left to punch. Okay, come on in, Sparky. Come on in. One at a time, please, though. One, one at a time. One, one at a, one at a time. Uh, am I punching you? Okay, punch, 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 punch. Uh, he's he's punching me, I think. And punch and punch. I, I don't seem to have a block of any sort. There we go. He went down. That really affected my health badly. Please say the red glowy thing is a med kit. Uh, med kit. Med kit. Med med kit. Oh, thank God. Okay, get that. And then whatever this is, an emergency drink. It's a little tiny bit hard to hover on those things. I'm going to back myself off here in traditional Project Zomboid fashion and see if we can maybe apply this med kit. So treat, swap, or drop. Well, I definitely want to treat my wounds. I absolutely want to treat my wounds there. So my health is back up to normal. I could do with a bite to eat. I've got the apple, but I don't think that's priority right at this exact second. So do I stop doing this or do I have to stop myself? Okay, we are putting the lunchbox away. Let's get back into fighty mode. I should have taken that whole boxer thing, shouldn't I? That would have been really good. Oh, this one moves. Yes, they often do. Um, oh, oh, hi, hi, hello, 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 hello. Okay, do you have like a a rhythm, a pattern? Are we Dark Soulsing this on up where I have to kind of monitor your, your rhythm here? Okay, punch, 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 punch. Get, get up and get punched. There we go. Get up, get punched. Okay, punching, more punching, and I'm doing a lot of punching. He's very... There we go. He's down. He's down. I lost a lot of health doing that. Okay, so note to myself, punching, not the way to go. Can we avoid? You know what? Go go out of uh, this. Can I avoid you? Because there's a lot of you over there. I can't jump over the curb. This is a problem. Do I have a sneak mode? How about that? Do I have like a sneaky stealthy mode here? Or am I just bumbling my way through here? Weapon allows two large weapons, one sidearm and one small melee. Large weapons do not fit in your pockets. No. What? Oh, I see the baseball bat. I was going to say I don't have any weapons. I see you. Okay, okay. Back it off, back it off, back it off. Okay, lose interest in me. I just need to very quietly... Gr no, stop it. Could you kick that over here, please? I'm going to murder you with it later. Could I just kind of swing up? Uh, yes. Got that. Um, get the, get, no, 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 back off, back off, back off. Okay, I need them to kind of lose interest in me, even though I'm standing in the middle of the road like a moron. Okay, I've grabbed the bat. I have grabbed the bat. Now, do I have to kind of apply the bat? No, the bat is right there. Yes, I want to equip that in my hand. Got it. Okay, get out of that. Now, go into, well, hitting people mode. So hit people mode, and then I kind of like to take you on not as a large... I'd actually just like to leave. I'd like to just back right out of here. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is so much better than punching. So, so much better than punching. Got two at a time there. Wrecked my health, but I got two at a time. How's that whole uh, health kit, kit thing holding up? Yeah, I don't got any more of those. This will give me stamina for the energy drink. And I could just eat the apple. But that's only hunger, that's not health. I'm going to die here, aren't I? Alright, I'm gonna... Oh, a kitchen knife. Oh, that's gotta be handy. I was gonna say I was gonna attack this guy, but I'm gonna take this kitchen knife. I'm gonna stick with baseball bat. Baseball bat's working out real good. Okay, real, real good on this guy. Okay, and get up and hit you, and hit you, and hit you. Okay. I don't actually think I lost any health with that one. I don't have my hopes up for the rest of this, but I'm, I'm doing kind of okay. okay hit you. Hit, hitting, more hitting, and get him while he's down. Get him while he's down. Get him while he's down. Just slam him in the back of the head. Come on. Okay, I think he's dead. I think that was a little bit of overkill. And I've got like a special execute move here that I can do if I were so inclined. I'd really, I'd really just like to walk past these guys. Aha! Stealth mode. Excellent. Oh dear, we're doing ranged weapons. Get a gun, some ammo... Oh, this ain't gonna go over well. An adventure backpack, you say? There's there's nothing in it. It's not that actually adventurous. I'm gonna take the adventure backpack though. Can I ha can I swap this? There's nothing in this at all. Okay. How about I can cycle through my weapons? Yes, I I'm, I'm probably can do that. Yeah. So get a weapon. 
Okay, and get some ammo, definitely, and some more ammo. Po poke along there, ammo. Okay, you've got a rifle, too. Well, let's get the hunting rifle. Let's just get everything. I bet you I'm not going to get this stuff back when we go out of tutorial mode, am I? So I guess I could put the rifle in my hands or the pistol and the knife. That would be my, my read on that. So if I, if I said I wanted to shoot you, how do we go about doing that? Can I crosshair you? Uh, go into, yeah, there we go. So can we get like a headshot on you? How do you work? Do I have any ammo in this? Do I have any ammo at all? Uh, quality 100%. I see that bit. Where did my ammo go? That's uh, not the 9mm, it's the 308. Do I drag you? How do I... How do we do this? Swap and drop. Nope. Nope. Now, despite my best intentions and several minutes of clicking things, I am completely, 100% stumped on how to load the gun. I'm going to have to do something insane, like go back to the main menu and actually read the tutorial tips. I'm embarrassed. Oh my goodness, it was just the R key. It was that simple. Oh. Some days are better than others around here. Okay, reload. There we go. I'm used to R being rotate. I do more building games than I do... You see where my brain went with that. Um, also pick up the hunting rifle, because we're not leaving that behind. Yeah, I get, get... Oh, my inventory is full. Full of what? Well, no. Oh, the axe. Yeah, because I just picked up the axe. Well, don't have that. No, no, don't, don't, don't have the axe. Just drop it for right now. You know what? We'll come back to axing. Okay, now, can I shoot you in the head? Yes, yes I can. Okay, probably don't use up, like, all the ammo, but, yeah, this seems to be working out just fine. Oh, uh, there, yeah, this, this is, this is good stuff. Um, oh, am I out of ammo? No, no. There we go. Okay. All right, so we've, after a long and prolonged battle with the R key, we've vaguely mastered shooting zombies in the head, and I can finally get my axe back and move on to crafting. I've grabbed a bunch of stuff, wood, tarp, rope, all this kind of stuff, and I'm being encouraged to go into the build mode. Do a campfire, a CB radio, yeah, I know I need stuff for that. Chemistry, cooking, workbench, saw, a fat converter, if only it were that easy in real life, distiller, furnace, gun bench, and melee bench. Okay, well, probably you want me to do the campfire, because that's that's kind of what we're doing here. Uh, so, can I just have that? Okay, I've done that, and then I've got to put the stuff in it. Gotcha, so I put the blueprint down, get out of that, please, and then I put stuff in it. Uh, craft an improvised hammer. Oh, dude, I might have just wasted all my stuff there. Uh, nope, there's all sorts of stuff right here. Never mind. Oh, yeah, all sorts of things. I could make a bow, a metal cleaver, barbed wire. I've got some of that. Scrap metal, nails, bait. Okay, so what did you want me to do? An improvised hammer, you say. An improvised hammer. There we go. I want to make one of those. Am I making that? I am making that right now. Okay. So it just pulled everything that it needed out of the inventory and I've, I've got that, and now i put it into my backpack, except now I'm carrying too much stuff because I've got a car battery. So let's go ahead and drop the car battery. I really hope that isn't important later. All right, I smashed up a car for some sheet metal because the game was kind enough to give me... Oh, my inventory is full. Uh, give me a car to smash and a sledgehammer to do it with. Fortify a window with a wooden barricade. Enter build, go to defense, wooden barricade, and then we're going to do... A thing. Can I actually have any of this? I just chopped up some wood in the sawmill there, so I might be a little floating some wood around here. So, what do we got? Defense. Oh, wow, yeah, you got a lot of defense, don't you? A lot of defense going on there, what with the zombies and all. Uh, what was the thing you wanted me to do? A wooden window barricade. Okay, I need the hammer. Ah, that's not in my hands, is it? Okay, hang on, get, get out of all of this. Go to this. I've got a lot of red-hot inventory management to do here. So I want... Just drop the sledgehammer. Drop the knife. I don't even really need that right now. There we go. My hammer is ready to go. So go back to building stuff. And where, where were we looking there? We were looking at the wooden window barrier. And that just snaps right to that. Now, do I need to do it? I need to add resources. And then I'm going to kind of very slowly put that together. Am I done? I appear to be done. Well, what else is in here? What's this? Storage and a weapon crate. Okay. And then some other things that are not active yet. Maybe they're 
still too early access, or maybe we just haven't unlocked them yet. And we could go fishing if we wanted to. I'm not going to for two reasons. One, I don't have any bait, and I don't have anything that I need to craft it, even though I'm probably looking right at it. It seems like that sort of tutorial. Two, uh, fishing minigames, and that's a hard pass on that. What I'm actually going to do is go test out my pistol, because I never got a chance to test that out. What with the whole debacle over the R key and whatnot. So if I go into, like, super sneaky mode here, and I just kind of come up. My pistol is loaded. We are kind of ready to go there. And then this is going to fire allegedly quickly, but probably not as powerful. Uh, and there we go. You're down. And you're down. And you're down. And you're down. And you're down. Nope. There you go. Level up, you say. Okay, can we look at some skills then? Well, alrighty. I've got two skill points. Survival, combat, and world. What are you giving me here? Lock picking. Well, that's got to kind of be handy. Bird watcher. Distance when using binos. I assume you mean binoculars. We don't... We don't really need an abbreviation for binoculars, do we? I don't think we do. And binos sounds very, very silly, doesn't it? Very silly. Resourceful. Less resources for building. Oh, that's very good. That's nice. Keep track of your friend's whereabouts. Yeah, I, I, we're not doing that. Gift to the Gab. Trader items. Now, I don't know if there's NPCs in the game or if that's trading with other human beings who are actually alive in the real world. Head smasher, smash a head, clean off. Sidearm, better damage with pistols. Well, that would be handy. Uh, bow, I gotta figure a bow's gonna be pretty good because I can, I bet you I can make the ammo for that. I don't need to find it. I think about that. Blade master with bladed weapons. Blunt weapons are gonna be better. More damage with fists. Less stamina while sprinting, or less stamina while vaulting and climbing. Yeah, I, I didn't really do well on the vaulting thing. Are those traps? Yeah, higher chance of catching food in traps, not necessarily zombies. Okay, what do these cost me? Every, every one of these seems to cost me two. Well, I would gotta figure. Oh, this only costs one. Lock picking has gotta be super handy. If you put it up as like a day one skill, it's gotta be really important. I don't wanna know where my friends are. Ah, uh, see, now I'm tapped out. I'm going to save that skill point. I'm going to bank that for something later. Now, when you say exit, is this a real exit or is this an exit into zombie territory? What have you got going on here? Okay, so far, so far, so good. I think I'm actually just leaving the tutorial area. Let's search the car. Oh, there's all sorts of good stuff. Old cereal and barbed wire. Electronics. Bottle of purify tabs. Oh, there's all sorts of neat stuff in here. What's going on down in this car? I don't have the capacity to carry any of this. Uh, yeah, search a van. There's got to be good stuff in a van. Might be Scooby-Doo. Uh, oil, fuel, another energy drink, more water bottles. Oh, I do love looting. You're not going to make me sad with a game that is hardcore focused on looting. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, we are definitely out of tutorial area. That guy, oh, oh, we're so out of tutorial area. Oh, I've made critical errors here. Critical, critical, crit critical errors. Crit reload, reload, reload. I am so, so dead soon. Uh, more, more shooting. I don't have, I don't, I don't have, no. I am so dead. Um, right. So that. Oh, and the respawn doesn't even put me anywhere good. Oh, it just puts me right back out here. Um, running away. I can't even get back to the tutorial area. The tutorial area is locked out to me. This has gone horribly, horribly wrong. Um, can I... I don't... I think I dropped my pistol somewhere around here. I know I can sprint, but, you know, stamina and whatnot. I, uh... I just... Oh my god, there's more of them. There's so many more of them. Um, let's do... Let's do a little bit of sprinting. Let's do some light sprinting. And then, um, light running away. And I'd love to be able to pan out so I can see what the heck I'm doing. Um, okay. Right. Survival guide. I am- I'm, I'm dead, right? That's your guide? Let me be honest, I'm not actually sure 100% what happened there. I got kicked back to the main menu. I'm- I'm looking at three options. Either I hit the wrong key, that's the most likely scenario, or that was the true end of the tutorial area. Here's a horde of zombies and you're dead. Now what do you want to do with the game? Or it was just sort of an early access glitch, I'm not really sure. But that's where we'll call it a day on Humanit Z. Humanit Z? Humanit Z? Humanit, Humanit Z? It just doesn't roll off the tongue. Guys, do please let me know what you thought of this in the comments below. I don't immediately dislike it. It's got kind of a Project Zomboid feel to it, and I could, I could tolerate that game. 
So guys, do please let me know what you thought of humanity in the comments below. And hey, if you enjoyed the video, do please leave a like down below. It does cheer me up no end when people do that. And if you're new to the channel, maybe just checking it out for the first time, feel free to hit that subscribe button. See more of this ridiculous nonsense. Until then, I'm Dave. Thank you, as always, for joining me in the wee hours. And we'll see you next time. But maybe we close the door during a zombie apocalypse, Cinnamon, huh? It's just basic security technique. If the door is closed, Cinnamon, Cinnamon, the zombies are going to have to work harder to get in. What you've done is put up a big sign on the top of your roof here that says, Hey, zombies, this way for food. All right, is there an actual fire? Or are you just telling me that fire is a thing that exists? Because I'm very familiar with that. Fire loves me, and it wants to be near me at all times. And I'm pretty sure they're trying to beat him to death with a baguette, which is less effective than you might commonly think it would be. I have created epic fruitcake. Those words have never been uttered in the entirety of human history. That sentence has never come together. I have made epic fruitcake.